Hey everyone, I've been doing this new thing, the uh, Akashic Creative Coaching Meditation Circle, and I know that's a bit of a mouthful, and I've been getting some questions about that, so I thought, how about I gather all these questions and then write down some of the answers, um, so I have like a list here, so I'll be looking uh, to make sure that I cover everything, and then just share a little bit with you uh, what it is, why you should join, how you can join, um, etc. And I also asked a couple of people who have been doing this work with me to share their experiences because it's one thing, like I can explain to you why I think this could benefit you, but I know from experience it's much better to hear from people who are actually doing the thing and um, explain in their own words, how it's helping them, how it's affecting um, their creativity, all of that. So that's what we're here for. Okay, so what is it? So first of all, people ask me, because I've been working with the Akashic Records um, personally since 2019, and I started incorporating it slowly into my coaching practice in 2022. And so people have been asking me, what is it? Like, what are the Akashic Records? Some people have heard about it. Some people have not heard about it. On the scale, like on the woo-woo scale, it's quite up there. I, I'm, it's, I keep saying it's the most spiritual thing I've ever done. Might not be the case. There might be things beyond this that I haven't even touched upon yet. But for me right now, like this is as spiritual as it gets, right? That's kind of um, where I am. So what is it? So... You can describe the Akashic Records as this metaphysical library where um, all of our soul's journeys are stored. The Akashic Records record records, um, records all of those journeys, right? So every incarnation that we have, we can find it all in the Akashic Records, past, present, future, potential future. So we're talking potential future timelines here because the future is not set in stone. Um, so... The work I do with the Akashic Records and with my clients is, as you know, I work mostly with creative people and I already tend to work with people who feel really stuck, who just don't know how to get out of a rut. They've been feeling uninspired for so long. They're, they have these patterns that they just cannot, like whatever, like they've tried so many things, they just cannot get rid of this pattern. Those are exactly the same people who can benefit from the Akashic Records, right? Especially if you've tried on, like, you've tried therapy, you've tried journaling, um, all kinds of things with, like, positive mindset, and you're just like, why can I not change this thing, right? Might be useful to go into the Akashic Records and see, okay, where does this block stem from? Where does this pattern stem from? What do I need to know about this, right? So... Yeah, so those are the people that I tend to work with, the tend of people that come my way. Um, and I have to say, like, it's been, like, it's such an honor, right, to be allowed to witness, like, their healing, their transformation, how they shed these old beliefs and, and patterns. Um, yeah, I mean, it's been... Like, I'm very grateful that I can do this work, right? And um, so I'm also very excited about this meditation circle because I've already been seeing... Um, if you hear any noises. That's my cat going to the litter box. Always perfect timing. Um, so yeah, so that's what I would like. Let's just share with you like uh, how this can benefit you. So specifically the meditation circle, what is that? So what I've started doing recently, I'm doing monthly guided journeys into the Akashic Records, which basically means that, um, like you can think of it as guided visualizations and meditations where I am your guide, right? I lead you into your own records and then I prompt you which questions to ask, what healing to ask for, and so on, right? So each month we dive into another topic. So last month the topic was... Um, like permission to create, right? So we went in to see, do I have any blocks there? Did I ever make any vows that I wouldn't create anymore, right? Because of something that had happened, right? Can we clear that so that I am free in this lifetime to create whatever I want to create? 
and then um, next week, so that is the 30th of November, we'll be talking, uh, we'll be diving in to figure out whether there are any blogs around fear of failure, right? So the fear of failure is, is the topic and we want to end up in a space where you give yourself permission to fail, right? Because giving yourself permission to fail means that you can make mistakes and we learn from mistakes. So you really need to give yourself that freedom, right? So if fear of failure is something you're struggling with, then that one is definitely for you. Um, the thing about this is that there's no order to this topic. So this is another question I've had, like you've already started this. Can I still join? Yes, there is no order to these topics. <coughs> Sorry. Um, so yes, you can join anytime. And if you become a paid member to the circle, so an actual circle member, you have like full access to the library of replays. So you can go back and see, be like, okay, that's a topic that I think I need to do. So you can do the guided journey on your own um, and do the healing. That, that's going to be part of that. And then let me see. Oh yeah. So, and this is for the, for the uh, paid circle members, if you become an actual member. So in between these guided uh, journeys, what we have is a coaching call. And in this coaching call, we reflect on, okay, what came up for you during the previous time? What of that have you been um, handling, right? What have you been tackling? Like, did you get any homework from the Akashic Records that you have been doing? Is there anything that brought up a lot of resistance? Can we maybe talk about that and see if we can work through it during this coaching call? Um, if, if it comes up, right, we can do some extra healing on the spots. I have quite a few uh, tricks up my sleeve. Um, we might, you know, after the reading, you might realize, okay, so I really have an outdated belief that wasn't even mine to begin with. Um, like that's what came up, right? Okay, can we work on releasing that? So that's the stuff that we do um, during the coaching call. And what the coaching calls, like it, like what they are about, very much depends on what the people who are there bring, right? Um, so that one is very open, right? Which I love, right? Because that just allows me to just go where we need to go. Uh, so that's been a really lovely experience. Um, let me see. I also need... <laughs> some water uh what else do i need to what other questions did you have mm. okay yeah so you do not have to become a paid member um like a monthly paying member to to join us right i know that's a bit of a commitment and i know how hard that can be like i struggle with that um so there's actually two ways you can join me you can either become a paid member you pay me monthly or you pay for uh, one year Right, and then you have a little bit of a discount. And as a paid member, you like there are benefits, right? So you have unlimited access to all the replays. Um, you will have access to the coaching calls. Um, there's an online space for you to connect with people. So the people are also on that journey. If you don't want to do that commitment, right? Like I said, I completely get that. If that's you, um, what you can then do is just look at the topics that we're going to uh, broach. And you can just buy a ticket for whatever speaks to you. So if you're like, uh, okay, no, my fear of failure is fine. But the one after the fear of failure one is the fear of success. So if you if that has been popping up in your life, the fear of success, maybe you want to say, you know what, I'm going to join the circle, uh, the life guided meditation that month, right? So then you do not do the coaching calls. You do not do the online um, group that we have going on. You just do the meditation and then you'll have access to the replay for the next month, right? So that's the difference. Thing is, um, price is the same, right? So a single ticket is 25 euros and joining monthly is also it's 25 euros a month. So whether you do it single ticket or you uh, become a paid member, it's 25 euros uh, a month. Um, and this is something that I also, <clears throat> because some people have been saying, isn't that a little bit low for what you offer? Absolutely, right? It's a lot, you get a lot for 25 euros a month. Um, but this is a conscious agreement <laughs> that I made with my own record keepers. Um, so yes, I go into the Akashic Records to be guided <laughs> about this, right? That's that's how I, how I roll these days. Uh, and I know that they will let me know when it's time to raise these rates. Um, so that is not like, that will happen at some point, right? For now, 25 euros a month is exactly where I need to be. Um, so I'm very happy with that. 
And then depending on how sustainable this is, um, I have this plan that everyone who sign who signs up like now when the price is still 25 euros a month, I want to see if I can keep that price the same for those people. So everyone who signs up in like the early days, like I said, depending on how sustainable that is, I'm hoping, like I'm currently committed um, to seeing if I can keep that price for them. So if you if you join later, you'll be paying the you know higher rate. But if you join early, I'm gonna do my best to keep it um, at the same rate. Um, and like I said, that will happen at some point. I don't know when yet. Um, anything else I need to say about that? No. So that's what I've been doing lately. Uh, and I know that some of you have been wondering about like, what is it that you're doing? So here it is. Um, this is it. And I wanted to, like I, like I said, I, I've asked some people uh, who have been doing this work with me uh, to share their experiences. Um, like I said, because it's so important to hear from other people. Um, so yeah, so I, I basically asked, okay, can you share like a line, like a line or two um, that I can share in this video? And then, <laughs> sorry, it's just really funny to me because I got these essays, right? Like some people wrote like half a page. Um, yeah, but I still, I'm going to share them with you anyway, because they do really bring home like what the work could do for you, like what the benefits could do. And that is they say it's so much better than I can ever do because I'm on this side, right? And they are on the other side. So they're on the receiving end of my guidance um, coaching, right? So let me, I'll start with, <laughs> I'll start with a long one. Um, I love this. Um, we're actually getting into winter now. So my throat is acting up. It's been really lovely. Okay, so I'll start with a longer one and see if I can do it without coughing. Um, okay, I joined Mariella's Akashic Records Meditation Circle because I was drawn to the records but didn't know how to work with them. Mariella's guided meditations into my records have helped me access them easily and given me guidance on what questions to ask and how to interpret the answers. Because the meditations are focused on my creative journey, they have helped me uncover the root causes of my blocks limiting beliefs and way faster than any other method I have tried before. And this helps me my way to fully embrace the creative I am meant to be. And then uh, they go on to say, the extra coaching calls Mariella does for the paid circle members keep me accountable to actually work on the blocks and insights that show up during the guided meditations into my own records. Mariella teaches me about the records and how to work with them. She gives guidance and shares her wisdom and knowledge while also giving me a kick in the ass when I need it. That's all I look for in a coach. So that is <clears throat> that is one of the uh, longer ones. Then I have I have another long one in the end. Uh, I have a couple of shorter ones here. So one of them, um, one of the people who've been working with me say, I was skeptical going into the Akashic Records as a journey. But what I found there is invaluable, right? And then I also have someone saying, uh, visiting the Akashic Records has changed my approach to my writing routine and better, it's helped inform what I should put my energy towards. And then one of them said, when I asked um, what I did for them, they said, during the journey I did with you, so me, I gained so much clarity about what's going on in my life, like about what, what um, the path is I should be walking and what's right and wrong for me. And I felt it too physically. My own beliefs became so clear to me, what's at the very core of me, right? Which I think is beautiful. And then, oh, I love this one. This is from someone um, from New Zealand, right? And this one really caught me in the feels. Uh, they say, um, Mariella has the perfect voice for guiding meditations. At every step of the process, I felt protected and safe. She's a brilliant kitiaki, which I'm sure I butcher that, but that is um, the T Rio Maiori, another thing I'm butchering, term for guardian, right? So that really, um, yeah, that just, yeah. Um, and then I have one, another short one before I go into the really long one. Uh, going into the Akashic crack, it sounded strange. Yeah, well, you know, that's exactly how I felt when I started doing this work. But now that I've done it, I know it's a safe, warm place to rest and heal. I've always been interested in self-improvement. And with Mariela's expert guidance, I've unlocked new levels of understanding. Right. Um, 
So here's the longest one uh, and also the last one, and then I'll, I'll leave you to it. Uh, I just hope that this gives you a little bit of a sense of, of, of what we do in these circles and, and how they can uh, help you. So this person says, when I first started these Akashic Record journeys with Mariella, I honestly had no clue what I was getting into. Yeah, I hear that a lot. Um, like I have a lot of clients who are like, I, I had no idea that this was going to happen. I knew about the Akashic Records, but it was pretty vague. Just another spiritual concept that didn't mean much to me. But wow, things changed fast. Just a few minutes into the first session, I could feel something different was happening. This wasn't like any meditations or healing work I'd done before. The images and feelings were so vivid and intense. It was like someone was downloading information directly into my brain within the most gentle way possible, which is, you know, exactly what happens when you go into the Akashic Records. That's exactly it. So they continue, what really stands out is how comfortable and safe the whole experience feels. Mariella creates this space where you can totally let your guard down. Each time we do a journey, I'm blown away by how spot on the insights are. The information feels like it's coming from somewhere way beyond just thinking or analyzing. It's deeper, more intuitive. Again, that's exactly the work, um, what the work is, right? And they continue, the best part, these insights stick with me. Days after the session, I'll suddenly understand something about myself or my life in a completely new way. It's like the journey keeps unfolding even after we're done. I've done a lot of personal growth work, but this, this is different. It's like having a direct line to some deeper wisdom with Mariella as the most awesome, supportive guide you could ask for. So I think <clears throat> that sums that up beautifully. I hope... Uh, if you had if you had questions, I know some of you had questions. If you had any questions, I hope I've answered them now. If not, please let me know. If you want uh, the link to where you can find even more information, let me know. If you want the link to how do I sign up, let me know. Leave a comment, message me, and I will get you these answers and I will get you that information. And I really, because I know this could benefit so many people, I really hope I'll, I'll see you soon. Um, during one of the uh, meditations. So thank you uh, for sticking with me during this entire video. Wishing you a beautiful rest of your day and weekend. Uh, it's Saturday, of course. Okay, bye.